Hey beautiful, it's Darby and welcome to my channel. Today I have another clothing haul for you guys. This is from a couple different stores and I want this to be a quick to the point video because the last couple videos I've done have been really long and lots of chit chat. So I just want to get straight to the point. I'm not going to tell you the prices. Everything will be linked down below if you want to buy anything. But I just want to show you what stores have what right now and what the clothing looks like on me so you can just go and buy it. So if you want to see what I bought this week, keep on watching. So the first store that I'm going to show you guys is Oaken Fort, and I got this beautiful little slip dress from there. This is in the size extra small. It's a beautiful gold color, the perfect gold. I love slip dresses right now. I love how they're making them to be worn by themselves and not as a slip to put under a dress. So this has beautiful little bikini straps, so elegant, so dainty. You can wear these with knee high boots, with heels, dress it up, dress it down, throw on a leather jacket and you're totally good. Next, I got this jumpsuit, and so in love with jumpsuits, if you know me and have watched my channel, I live in jumpsuits because they're so comfortable. So this one's really baggy, it's a one size fits all, so it is quite baggy on me, but it fits the cleavage area pretty good. It's a little bit low, but it's nice, you don't have to wear a bra with it. It has two pockets in the front, it is cropped at the legs, super comfortable, as I said, one size fits all, so you'll definitely have to go in store and try it on. I wouldn't suggest ordering offline because one size fits all is a little deceiving because obviously it's not gonna fit us all so yeah in love with this super comfortable and definitely gonna get a lot of wear out of this next from Oak and Ford I got this long t-shirt dress and I'm really sorry it has fake tan all over it and I spilt stuff on it and I'm gonna wash it but I dug it out of the wash to show you guys it's really really long and it has a slit down the center so you could either wear this by itself because the slits low enough to wear it by itself as a dress and just wear like little booties with it or I actually had some jeans under it the other day cut off ones and they were so cute it is sleeveless I got this in a size extra small so if you're gonna order off of Oak and for it offline make sure if you're about my size um, get an extra small because everything runs a little bit big I wish they had like an extra 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 small but yeah this is super cute it's gonna be good for summer and winter in winter you can throw on a leather jacket and jeans or in the summer you can just throw this on with flip-flops and just wear it by itself so definitely a good find and last from Oak and Fort, I got this purse that I've been eyeing for quite a while now. It says Oak and Fort right there. It is just a nice, like, I don't know if it's faux. Probably a faux leather material. The button here, the clasp, is super strong, so it actually stays together, not like some purses, and it doesn't have any pockets inside. I just have a bunch of my junk in there. But I love this color for spring. I can carry it into summer. It is such a beautiful pastel color. It was a little bit more on the expensive side, but definitely worth it. So the next store I popped my head into was Topshop, and when I saw the color of these, well, Probably the 50% off sign caught my eye first, but when I saw the color of these, I went running up to them because these are definitely my colors and these just scream my name and they have to be part of my wardrobe. So everything I own will go with these boots because I pretty much only own black things, white things, taupe, tan, nude, and like gold. So yeah, and light pink, so these will be absolutely perfect in my wardrobe. They're not too high, so you can kind of wear them on a daily base. They're so comfortable. I wasn't too sure if Topshop would sell really good quality shoes, but these seem to be amazing quality. They're so comfortable. I swear the padding inside is all like cushioned. It is so comfortable. I can't wait to get lots of wear out of these. I'm gonna be that crazy woman in the summer wearing like boots in like 30 degree weather, but whatever, I'll wear these with my bathing suit. <laughs> so, so far, loving these I'll let you guys know how comfortable they are after like a long day of wearing them but so far so good next up from Topshop we have a pair of jeans and you guys know Topshop is legendary for the jeans they fit everybody absolutely perfectly so these ones are really really stretchy which is good because the lady uh, Topshop said I always need to go for stretchy jeans because my waist is really tiny and then my legs from working out are a little bit thicker so my problem is always that I go for a size that fits my legs and then the waist is just like a thousand inches too big. So these fit absolutely perfect, really tight on my waist and on my hips and on my legs, which is nice. And then they are cropped and then they are a little bit distressed at the bottom. Look at this, like they're literally jeggings. They are so stretchy, but these fit perfectly. They're high-waisted. I don't buy any jeans that aren't high-waisted now. I don't know, I just hate the feeling of low-rise jeans because jeans 
are uncomfortable to begin with. And then when they're falling off your butt and falling off your hips, they make them even more uncomfortable. So high rise, high waisted jeans are my thing. <laughs> Next up from Topshop, I have a t-shirt dress and I went specifically to Topshop to get this t-shirt dress. I wanted to wear it with my thigh high boots. Short sleeve, really distressed, has holes in it. And I just looked at the price here. This was $58. I went to their custom fitting and she was just handing me a bunch of stuff, just try this on, and I didn't even look at the prices, and I just bought everything, and my bill did come to like $400. So this is totally why. I didn't know this was gonna be $60. I thought it was gonna be like 24 bucks. But anyway, really cute, really good material, super distressed, super cool, and this will look dope with fat high boots. And the last thing from Topshop was this belt. I really needed a belt and the girl that was doing my personalized fitting was wearing this with just like a band t-shirt, high-waisted mom jeans, and this just really spiced up her outfit. So I was like, okay, I need that. That looks so cute. And it was $54, but I needed a belt and I think this is definitely worth it because it's really heavy, really good quality, and it just is really unique. It looks like it'd be like a designer belt, but $54, so definitely think it was worth it. So next store I shopped off was boohoo.com, an online store. I have two other Boohoo hauls. If you wanted to check them out, I'll link them down below. But you're probably thinking, really, Darby bought thigh-high boots. It's almost summer. Well, I feel like I deserve them because I've been looking for thigh-high boots for over a year, seriously. And it's either they don't have my size, they don't cling to my thighs or my legs properly, or they're like $300 from Nordstrom, so, and they, they would have fit perfect, but $300, I'm not spending that on shoes. So these were like 60 bucks. I got these in a size seven. They are really, really comfortable. And if you're under like five, six, five, seven, I definitely wouldn't get these unless you have really long legs and a short torso. Yeah, <laughs> then I definitely wouldn't suggest these because these are so high. Like they're crazy, crazy high. They're pretty much pants. And I found it really hard to find like a skirt or to find a dress or shorts that are short enough to go with these. But other than that, which I like about that, but other than that, they cinch in here at your upper thigh. Don't put them too tight because then it looks like you have sausage legs or sausage thighs. <laughs> but yeah, in love with these. They fit perfectly, really comfortable. I've worn these out a couple times already. Yes, they're comfortable. Yes, they fit good. They don't fall down too much down your thigh throughout the night. And I'm so excited that I finally have thigh high boots. Next from Boohoo, I'll have to show you in the cutaways because you won't be able to see this, it will just look like a big blob, but this is kind of a trench coat, super cozy, oh my goodness, it's like just having a blanket over top of you. It was really cold in Vancouver the other day and all I had was a t-shirt on underneath this and I was boiling, boiling hot. So. Definitely does its job, really warm. The sleeves are a little bit big because it's a one size fits all. Obviously hate one size fits alls, but it was really good quality. It wasn't very expensive. You can cinch it in at the waist and I'll probably get the sleeves hand or just roll them up a little bit. But I think this is definitely a good staple to have in your wardrobe. And last thing I got from Boohoo was this maxi dress. And I got it in a size two, but it's still quite big around the bust area. Surprise, surprise. <laughs> but it's so heavy and good quality that it does weigh it down a little bit. I mean, if you had boobs, maybe you wouldn't have this problem. <laughs> but it's really good material. I love just being able to throw on a maxi dress or a romper or just a play suit and run out the door and look good. So this one is definitely one of those kind of outfits. I might get it hemmed a little bit at the sides because it is quite heavy and it is falling down on me, but it was pretty cheap and definitely worth it. So the last store is super random. It's actually Urban Planet. So my boyfriend was getting a new phone the other day and at the mall, so I just like popped into Urban Planet being like, okay, what do they have? Maybe like a tank top or something I can buy. And they actually had really good stuff. They definitely stepped up their game. I guess they had to because there's so many good stores out there and online stores that they kind of had just like cheap, gross, ugly clothing. So yeah, definitely stepped up their game. The first thing I got there was these leggings and they fit like a glove. They are so comfortable, perfect for like plain attire. Honestly, you could probably wear these to the gym. Like they're really comfortable. High-waisted, have a cute little detail here. They don't 
it's just like sewn on there for looks. And I love anything that has like a light pink or a beige with black and white. I think those definitely complement each other, those colors. But definitely in love with these leggings. And the next two things I got from Urban Planet, I'm actually wearing right now, and I'll wear them this evening, so I'm not gonna take them off. I'll just show you guys in a cutaway. So the first thing is this white bodysuit. So cute, so into it, and I actually love them with these joggers. So these joggers are camo, they have cutouts at the knees, and these are actually in a large, which I thought was so weird. I tried on the extra small, and then I couldn't even get it past my ankles. And yeah, I just had to keep on going bigger and bigger and bigger, so I don't know know what people bigger than me would wear. I think that's really, really unfair. But anyway, these fit me really cool, really good. They're kind of baggier at the waist, have like a lower crotch, rips at the knees, and yeah, they're joggers, so they're tighter kind of at the bottom. And I'm so in love with these. I think it looks so dope with this bodysuit, and it would definitely match like everything in my wardrobe, so I definitely thought these were good finds. Okay guys, so that was everything in my clothing haul for today. Everything you saw will be linked down in the bottom or the names to it, my sizes, um, maybe how much it is, but if you just click on the link, it will just bring you there. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Got some fashion inspiration, and maybe this will inspire you to go and pick up a few new pieces. Everything was relatively not too expensive, pretty affordable, kind of something that maybe everybody can afford. So I hope you guys all enjoyed this, and if you did like it, please give it a like, and if you're not subscribed to my channel, I'd appreciate it so much if you subscribe down below. Let me know if you like hauls in the comments, comment down below, tell me what videos you guys wanna see, and thank you so much for watching. I love you so much for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye.